A deadly day on Oahu's roads. Two people are dead tonight, both killed while trying to cross the street. In Kailua, a 79 year old woman struck and killed while crossing Kailua Road about 11.30 this morning. KITV Force Pete Caggiano spoke with area residents who believe something needs to be done to make this crossing area safer. Because there's so many different things going on, different directions of people coming. And those distractions may have contributed to today's fatal crash, which claimed the life of a 79 year old pedestrian. About 11.30 this afternoon, here in Kailua, by the 7 Eleven by Kailua High School, a female in her late 70s was crossing Kailua Road in a marked crosswalk. Officers say the fast lane of traffic Kailua bound stopped, but unfortunately, the slow lane did not. This Toyota Highlander behind me struck and killed the pedestrian. The woman was taken from the scene in critical condition, but later pronounced dead at Castle Medical Center in Kailua. Local residents and business owners were saddened by today's news, but not too surprised. They say this intersection has been a problem for years. It's a very dangerous intersection because a lot of the kids come through here for school, and a lot of the old folks cross, and we noticed that a lot of people come ripping through this area. And some think it's time for the state to act to make this stretch of roadway safer for both pedestrians and drivers. I've thought for years that they should have a um, light there because it's really hard when you're crossing. You get people that are turning that don't pay attention and they just try to rip in front of you. Officers want to remind pedestrians and drivers alike to be aware and alert to try to prevent fatal accidents like today's. Not commenting in, on this specific accident, but generally speaking, that we ask that both drivers and pedestrians look out for each other. Now, police do not believe speed or alcohol were to blame for this accident. Back to you. All right, thanks, Pete.